we're going to go into this will probably be a separate video this is going to be the hue to beauty stuff and well i just washed my hands and it still is on there oops oh well that's from the natasha Den denona palettes that i just did we're going to go through the nine pans that i have and then the larger palettes this is one of the obsessions palette it is the smoky obsessions i love these that's just all i'm gonna say is i love these i love these little nine pan palettes so that's why i have the majority of them this is the emerald palette these look really super good on my daughter um, she has similar coloring as to me except she has her father's blue eyes and some shades just look, just pop her eyes and i just they, they just look really wonderful on her this is, of course, the Sapphire, and you can tell, again, it's got that royal blue. Guys, we are almost done. We've almost finished this cabinet. I didn't realize there was this much. Um, this is a Purple Haze. This one is just pretty. It's just pretty. Um, it's a softer plum pinky, shimmery, it just, it's just there. Um, now, we get into the wilds. I, I'm doing these in no order because as you can see behind me, there's still a whole bunch in the cabinet that are cute to beauty. Um, this is one of the wild palettes. My hand's shaking, I'm sorry. Um, this is the chameleon uh, I have to use it a couple more times. I wasn't overly fond of it the one time that I did use it. Um, it may get passed along because it just didn't, the colors are pretty. It just didn't, I couldn't get it to really work like I wanted it to. This may just be one of those things that's better for somebody else. This one is a wild python. Um, again, this is, these are colors that just really look good on my daughter more than me, but, you know, like I said, some things we just both use. Um, there are palettes in her room that I have missed. Oh, well, we'll pick them up later or we won't. I don't know. This is the Wild Jaguar, and out of them all, this is my favorite. Um, it is just really, really pretty. Um, it's not... A very it's not a heavy look so I can pull it off easy and I like easy I didn't think this was gonna take as long as it did but here we go we're back we're still doing hue to beauty this is of course the mob obsessions um, and you can see why it's in my collection um, I've had it for a, quite a while I think I have a backup of it too this is the electric obsessions I love this one. I think this is a backup. Um, this is the Hue to Beauty Ruby Obsessions. I'm sorry. I'm getting, I'm getting tired and my brain is going, we're done. We really want to be done with this. <laughs> this is the Hue to Beauty Amethyst. And of course, you can tell the purples, the pinks. That's me. Um, the pastels, this one is my favorite. It is the, the lilac. This is the pastels mint. I can wear this one pretty easily, but this is another one that just really looks really super good on my daughter. And pastels rose absolutely adore this one it just it's soft and so pretty um this is another this is the khaki haze the order that these used to be in they are not anymore because i'm just putting them back in there and bringing them getting the next stack out so we can hurry up and get through with this because we're close this is a sand Haze palette, again, you can, you, by now you pretty much know, color story, it's going to get me every single time. Okay, we can do this, we're, we're getting to the end. This is, 
I'm gonna have to show it to you kind of because I broke it the blue of all colors for me to break. This is a Huda Beauty gemstone collection of, of gemstone obsessions. I have a I have at least one backup of this one because yeah it's pretty it's really pretty it's really pretty on the eyes and yeah when they started to be discontinued I snatched backups that's what this little area is is backups of these that were my favorites and I grabbed them this is the coral obsessions um it's not it's kind of lower on my list but it's a good palette nonetheless um this one, when I seen it, I absolutely fell in love with it. It is the gold palette. Phew, I'm getting tired. I'm gonna have to stop and fix dinner here. Wait a minute. This is one of the nude palettes. I have all three of them. This is the lightest one, and I love this one. This one is a real quick Sunday morning, boom, I look done, or any other time, but it is one that is in the rotation for Sunday. Um, this is the caramel. I have never had it out of the package. We're not going to take it out now because I'm trying to get through this. This is the chocolate brown. This is the toffee brown. I will do a get ready with me at some point. Because like I said, I'm getting tired and we're almost done in this bathroom. Fingers crossed. This is the medium. Sorry, my hand is shaking. Um, nude palette. I love this one too. This is the rich. This one I can't use by itself. I have to pull colors out of another palette because it just gets too deep for me. But I love it anyway because it's a really nice, super nice, nice palette. We can see the finish line. <laughs> this is a party animal palette that was a Laura Lee palette that I got in a boxy charm. I couldn't tell you when. Uh, it's I've used it a couple of times. It's kind of nice. Um, it's why it's mixed in with these I really couldn't tell you. We're going to just go through these how they are stacked because I, yeah we're just we're just ready to be done <laughs> and this is not even there's still a whole other bunch to do. This is a Huda Beauty Mercury Retrograde palette. I really, really like these palettes. Um, really enjoy Huda's formula. Um, this is the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk palette. Let me show you again because I'm getting... I'm getting tired and it's getting quicker and quicker because I'm tired. I didn't think, I didn't realize, I mean, I knew I had a lot of makeup. I didn't realize it was this much. This is the New Nude palette. I use this one a lot. This one, um, not so much the glitters, the mattes, and the these. This is the Huda Beauty Gold Palette. This one gets quite a bit of love, as you can see. It's kind of loved on more than most of the palettes that I own. If this is the Rose Gold Remastered. This is the Naughty Palette. It is, I bought it just namely because of the color story. It is not one that I go to a whole lot. I, didn't, I don't care for it as much as I thought I would. Um, so, yeah. This is one that I just bought. Um, it's the Rose Quartz. This one, I, I just love the court, color story. Um, we'll do a get ready with me with, with it for long. This is the Huda Beauty... Rose Gold Collection. I think this was the first one. I used it quite a bit before it became remastered, and I really don't know why, what happened, or anything like that. But, you know, it's, I've got it. I've kept it. And 
all this time. Who knows why? Okay, one second. There's a point where everything just kind of goes downhill, and we're kind of getting there. This is, oh my goodness, this is one of my favorite palettes, and I will forever keep it. This is the Tati Beauty palette. Um, it just pretty much has everything all in one palette. Um, and it's like the easiest palette ever to use. And I really, really wish there could be more Tati Beauty makeup. Okay, home stretch, guys. This is a Laura Mercier palette. It is gems. Oh, I'm sorry, hidden gems. I actually, I bought it off Costco, or, or from Costco. I like it pretty much. This is another Smashbox palette, and I may have told you a fib. This may have been, no, it wasn't. It was the other, other one. This one has been in my purse, so you can see where I've dug my fingernail in it. Accidentally, this is a Smashbox uh, cover shot palette. I love these little palettes. I love them so, so very much. Okay, we're going to get into, these are just basically, I've kept them way too long. They still smell like chocolate. Oh, well. Can I, can these I stay? You may. These are, this is a Too Faced chocolate bar. Uh, it's one of the, when I started doing makeup again after my little stint with Unique. This is one of the, well, I might have bought it before. I can't remember now. Um, then I have the, wait a minute. Then I have the chocolate bar palette. And I mean, I couldn't tell you how many years, a good five years at least longer than that because my dad was still living whenever I got these. Um, Excuse it, me. One second. Let me finish this up real quick. This is the Too Faced Peach Palette. Um, eventually, one day, I'll toss them. but <laughs> It's not going to be today. I have good memories. This one, I literally have never used it. My daughter bought it for me. Uh, I think the first, the first Mother's Day or birthday or something like that after she came back home, and it will stay with me probably till there are no more days. What would you like to say, son? What happens to that little palette? It's just how it's made. Oh. Sorry, that's going to shake you just a little bit, but I'm trying to get to the end of this because. You're probably what? like me and really tired. This is a Nobla palette that, that some, for whatever reason, is in the wrong spot. It's, it's a cutie palette. It is the Metropolitan palette. Would you please count the number of pans? One, two, three, four, five, six. Thank you so and, very much. And, Grammy, I have also something to say. What? Uh, now... Uh, I love you, and what what part is this? Uh, I lost count. We're, we're getting closer to done, though, at least in this bathroom. This is, I, I should have pulled these whenever I had the Urban Decay palettes out, but hey. I didn't. These, these were from the Prince Collection. The uh, biggest reason why I didn't pull them is I bought these for my daughter. Uh, bought them on sale. I like the colors in here. Um, I've not used it, but she has. That one's a 10 palette. Thank you. I'm sorry. I forgot to let you count it. I'm getting tired. So This is the other Prince palette. This, these were the only two things from the collection that we picked up. And Now let me count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yes, please don't stick your fingers in. Okay? I do not. Because you'll get it, you, it gets everywhere once it gets on your fingers. Okay, we are, I promise, so close to done in this bathroom. In here I have backups of the Tartlet palettes that I've shown you already. 
um, I have one Bobbi Brown palette. I like it really well. I just Oops. never purchased any more. I'm not doing it. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Please be still. This is why I've told you you have to be still. Anyway, this is the Bobbi Brown Crystal Drama palette. I've had it forever. Please stop. Please stop. Okay, 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 I'm living. You don't have to leave, you just have to stop. That was just a fail, guys. Okay, these are, oh my goodness, these are poor beat up Stila palettes that I've had probably way too long. Beat up. This one's not as beat up as. Oh no! What? Well, that one's gone. <laughs> Hit pan on that real quick. I can't. I think they were in my, one of my bags and got dropped. I can't remember now. Um, now you got broken palette. This is one of this another little Stila. Let me. See. And stop. <laughs> Sorry. Please stop. This is a Libertine palette. It's a Viseart palette. And let me count. I can't get it back open. Yeah, but what? Count quickly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Thank you. It's a nine pan. Uh, Viseart. I do awesome. like busy art. I just quit using these a whole lot because, well, as you can see, this is a golden hour palette. Um, as you can see, I'm overwhelmed. Um, I did not realize this would be this big of a job to tackle. And we are not done. This is the Trist palette. Which also has nine. And it is a, you can see the reason why it's in my collection. Over. We're just, we're getting done with this one. I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise. Sorry, I'm just tired. Well, then you can go do something else, honey. You don't have to stay in here with me. Yeah, but why did you decide to do a collection? I don't know. I think I lost my marbles. These are two busy art palettes. Um, Which are 12? Yes. I can't see the names of them. One is Bright Satin and the other is Editorial of Brights. My goodness, <laughs> I honestly didn't. I'm gonna get really I don't know. I need to. I probably need to declutter. This is another busy art palette. I'm trying to be mindful of the time because I know these get lengthy quick. Um, it's a coral palette, a coral toned. It's whipped. No, I can't read upside down anymore. Petite Pro Ap Apricotine palette. Guys, I really didn't know this was going to take this long. Um, and there's still another bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> this is the Petite Pro 17H. Again, it's a nude shade. I promise you we are almost done with this bathroom. I promise you. This is Petite Pro 2 18A. This is a Viseart. Holy. I have lost my mind, children. Petite Soleil. This one is pretty. Let's I'm going to show you that one again because I'm getting quick because I'm looking at the thing and I'm trying to not keep you 
tied to this for very long. Um, these are three NARS palettes that may be the same thing that's been known to happen in my world more than once. <laughs> That one it is copper I promise we're almost done I really really promise if anybody's counting let me know besides too many okay this is the NARS quartz palette Taking them all out of the box because it take up the box takes up more space than I really need. Um, my poor little Stila palette. I guess it's just I probably should discard them there. I may just clean them and keep using them. I don't know. They're really I've had them for a really long time. Okay. This is suede. Little man is in the room playing. So if you hear him singing or whatever, that's what's happening. He's in on my bed having a good old time. Okay, now we just have a few more to go. We're going to finish these up because i got to make dinner. Okay? <laughs> oh, people. People, people, people. I really honestly did not realize that... This was the extent of, oh my goodness. I did not realize that this was this much. And like I said, there's still another bathroom. Um, this is a rental palette. I think my daughter bought it for me. I really can't remember. It's never, oh, maybe it has been opened. Yeah, it's been opened um, so for the money. Price point, it's a good palette. I like Rimmel. Um, good drugstore brand. Violet Boss palettes. Here we go. This is, like I can see this without my glasses, guys. Come on. This is a fun-sized Berry Burst palette. I guess it would help if I showed it to you, wouldn't it? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm getting very, very tired by now. This this has taken a long, a lot longer than I expected. This is the Violet Boss Cream Brulee palette. I bought a backup because I like this palette really well. This is. A Violet Boss Windflower Palette. A Wild Windflower. I'm sorry. Yeah. I think it's time to be done for today. It's going to take me a month to get all this put back where I had it. This one is pretty. This is a forget-me-not Violet Boss palette. And this is the Essentials by Violet Boss. And guys, to the best of my knowledge, um, save a errant, 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 I can't even say words anymore, palette that may be in my daughter's room. That's it for this bathroom. We will work on the next bathroom later. But thank you for staying, hanging out with us today. We hope you enjoy these. I don't know why I chose to do this because it was a job. Um, kind of eye-opening too. I need to do some clean. Some, I need to pass some more along than what I have. Um, That'll be another day. We may declutter another day. Usually, I just, if somebody's here, I'm like, hey, do you like this? Take it. 
Um, so anyway, thank y'all for hanging out with us. We got through it. Have a great day. I'm the mayor's daughter. Mayor's great grandson's in there playing. We'll see you. Bye. Hey, stop. Okay. I'm the mayor's great grandson. Sorry, guys. I'm the mayor's great grandson. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. I was late. You're okay. You're absolutely fine. <sighs> Tell him, see, we're done with this bathroom. We're done with this bathroom. Finally. Finally. <laughs> so now we just have to do the half bath. I <gasps> just have to do the half bath. In there is all of our color pop. There's some more B and H. Um, there's an Estee Lauder palette, and there might be some Morphe palettes. I can't remember. Most of the color pop is in that bathroom. I know. I know. There's a problem. <laughs> Y'all have a great day. Remember, I'm the mayor's daughter. subscribe and hit the bell so you can get one of my credits one of your credits okay <laughs> yeah so, and let's do our own credits honey we may do a giveaway later not but not today okay see bye we'll see you later don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell again i'm the great great grandson and i'm the mayor's daughter have a great day. See ya. Bye. See ya.